Hello everybody. Welcome to the 120th installment of Logo History. Today, I'm going to talk about a Barth, Orange S.A., Cloven Pure Ox, 2022 FIFA World Cup, Canadian National Railways and Asothiathion Chile Nauti Conservation del Patrimonio Ferroviario. Cloven Pure Ox, Canadian National Railway and ICPF were requested by Lexi Theo Merlin 5529 and Orange and Abarth were requested by Logo 4339. Check out their channels by clicking on the cards above. I really hope you like it. First, I'm going to talk about Orange SA. Orange SA is a French multinational telecommunications corporation. It has 266 million customers worldwide and employs 89,000 people in France and 59,000 elsewhere. In 2015, the group had revenue of 40 billion euros. The company's head office is located in the 15th arrondissement of Paris. 2013 to the present, there is an orange square and on the bottom of it, there is the word orange in white text. All right, now I'm going to talk about Asothiathion Chile Nauti Conservation del Patrimonio Ferroviario. Asothiathion Chile Nauti Conservation del Patrimonio Ferroviario or the Chilean Association for the Conservation of Railway Heritage is a Chilean non-profit organization that urges for the conservation of rail infrastructure and rolling stock. 1983 to the present, there is a maroon oval ringing on it. There are the words Asothiathion Chile Nauti Conservation del Patrimonio and Ferroviario in golden text and inside the ring. There is a gold and maroon picture of steam train. All right, now I'm going to talk about Cloven Purox. Purox is a German line of dish soap and laundry detergent. Something to the present, there is the word Cloven in white text on a light blue outline and under that, there is the word Purox in blue gradient text. So and think to the present for the Purox color variant, the word Cloven was removed and now under the word Purox. There is a rainbow gradient rectangle and on it, there is the word color in white text. Alright, now I'm going to talk about 2022 FIFA World Cup. The 2022 FIFA World Cup is an international football tournament contested by the men's national teams of FIFA's member associations. The 22nd FIFA World Cup is taking place in Qatar from 20 November to December 18, 2022. It is the first World Cup to be held in the Arab world and the second held entirely in Asia after the 2002 tournament in South Korea and Japan. At an estimated cost of over $220 billion, it is the most expensive World Cup ever held, this figure is disputed by Qatari officials. 2009-2017, there are two white scores on black outlines and on the first square, there is a soccer ball surrounded by a bunch of yellow light blue and dark blue hexagons and under them, there are the words Qatar in 2022 in maroon and light blue text and on the second square there is the 1960-2020 Qatar Football Association logo and under it, there the words Qatar Football and Association in black text and to the left of that, there is some Arabic writing and under the squares, there are the words Bidding Nation and Qatar in black text. Here is the bid variant. 2017 to 2019, there is the word Qatar in both English and Arabic writing in maroon and under the word, there are the words see you in and 2022 in maroon text. 2019 to 2022, there is a grey 3D shape with some maroon designs and under it, there are the words FIFA World Cup Qatar in 2022 in maroon text. Here is the qualifiers variant, the slogan and the animated variant. All right, now I'm going to talk about Canadian National Railway. Canadian National Railway is a Canadian Class I freight railway headquartered in Montreal, Quebec, which serves Canada and the Midwestern and Southern United States. 1918 to 1923, there is a black circle with three white shapes and in between the shapes, there are the words Canadian and National in white text. 1923 to 1943. There is a red rectangle on a white outline and on it, there are the words Canadian and National in white underline text. 1943 to 1954, there is a green maple leaf and on the top of it, 
There is the word CNR in white text and under it, there is a black rectangle on a white outline and on it, there are the words serves all and Canada in white text. 1954 to 1960, there is a red maple leaf on a black outline and on it, there is a black square and on it, there are the words Canadian National and Railways in yellow underlined text. 1960 to the present, there is the word CN in red text. Alright, now I'm going to talk about a Barth. A Barth is an Italian racing and road car maker and performance division founded by Italo-Austrian Carlo Abarth in 1949. A Barth is owned by Stellantis through its Italian subsidiary. 1949 to 1954, here we have the first name of a Barth, a Barth and Company. There is a shiny scorpion and under it, there are the words a Barth and C Torino in red text. 1954 to 1958, there is a red and yellow shield on a blue and yellow outline with a black shiny scorpion and on the blue outline, there are the words a Barth and Co in yellow text on a black outline with a red underline. 1955 to 1958, here we have the second name of a Barth, a Barth and C. The font has changed and the logo is lighter. 1958 to 1969. There is a red yellow and blue shield and on the yellow and red parts, there is a blue scorpion on the black outline and on the blue part, there are the words a Barth and C in yellow text and the whole shield is on the black outline. 1969 to 2007, they finally changed their name to a Barth. There is now only the word a Barth is white text. Now under the blue part, there is a red and black wave, the scorpion is now black and the logo is now on a yellow outline. 2007 to the present, the black and yellow outline is now silver, the font has changed, the blue part is now black, the scorpion is now on a silver outline and the wave is now an Italian flag. Alright, that was it for today's episode, but stay tuned for episode 121, where I'm going to talk about Fuji Television, Little, Wex and Nivea. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. Follow me on Twitter at EpicLogo, follow me on TikTok at EpicLogotube and watch me on DeviantArt at MS Paint Comic Artist and until the next one, bye.